Hey guys, what's up? It's Saturday here. I'm actually sitting in my closet because I need to clean it out. So sorry about that, but I just have a lot to do and the day is short. But I thought it would be kind of funny because I'm cleaning out my closet and I'm going to talk to you about the juice cleanse that I did this week. If you've been following along on Instagram, you saw that I did a three day juice cleanse. And first of all, I just wanna say thank you because a lot of you have been really supportive um, and you asked some questions and things like that. And I said there'd be a video about it cause there will be and this is it. So the first biggest question I got was what exactly was I doing? So sorry, I'm gonna like actually do stuff while I talk to you. So what did I do? I did a three day juice cleanse. So I did nothing but drink fresh juice, um, fruit and vegetable juice for three whole days. It means no eating solid foods. It's just a way to kind of detox your system and you only drink juice. You cannot eat any solid foods. You also drink a ton of water, obviously, and you can also drink tea. So I just drink a lot of green tea because it's like for detoxing purposes, lots of antioxidants and things like that. Um, another question I got a lot besides what the heck was I doing is why. So the reason why I did this is because I went to America recently, as you should know if you've been following along. If not, watch some other videos, I guess. Um, so I went to America and one of the best things about America is all the food. And as much as it tastes really good, I ate so much crap. So much more meat than I usually eat when I live in Israel. So much greasy, oily food. And then I came back to Israel just in time for Hanukkah. And so during Hanukkah, it's tradition that we just eat a lot of food cooked in oil. So we eat latkes, which are like potato pancakes, and they're fried in oil. And we eat sufganyot, which you guys saw me eating tons of them, and it's just fried dough and oil filled with sugar and um and so my body just really f was feeling that and i kind of wanted to do a sort of reset button kind of thing um and so that's why i did the juice cleanse um how did it go so i'm gonna show you a lot of like how it went and i reflected a lot on it during the actual cleanse so you'll see that in a minute in general i think that the juice cleanse is equally if not more mentally challenging as it is physically challenging. I really learned a lot about my habits, my eating habits. Um, I learned a lot about my personal self-discipline, holding myself accountable to things, and I'm really glad I did it right now. But enough of you watching me literally sort my socks. Uh, let's just see how the juice cleanse went. Morning, so we're going to do the quick rundown of juices today. Okay, we have to start. Juice cleanse day one. Wheatgrass shot with it's basically like 50% wheatgrass, pomegranate juice, cayenne pepper, lemon. That's the start of the day. This is our breakfast juice. These are orange, carrot, persimmon, turmeric, and lemon. So that's our breakfast. This is our tea that goes throughout the day. It basically has everything in it for our kidneys, our adrenal glands, our lymphatic system. What else? It's, it's just super yummy and good for you. Um, then these are sort of lunch and dinner. These two are... Wait, no. This one is beetroot, chard, apple, ginger and lemon. And this one is celery, red cab mainly red cabbage, a whole red cabbage, celery, apple, ginger. And these are our, like our sweet afternoon candy. It's basically like 90% pomegranate and then apple and lemon juice. Ginger. There you go. Okay. Hello everyone. I'm vlogging for the first time from the office, which I will not reveal where it is. Josh, I'm in the middle of a vlog. What are you doing? When you finish, <laughs> make sure that you rinse out the bottles. Okay. And I'll bring them all back for you tomorrow. Okay. Juice cleanse day one. First bottle is, I don't know, but Josh described what it is. And uh, wish me luck. I look terrible, right? 
Yeah, so um, it's like 10.30 on the first day of the juice bash, and I finished my last juice, the dinner juice. And I just don't feel awesome, to be honest. My head hurts, and I just feel really drained. So I don't know if I'm going to make it four whole days, but I want to try at least two, and maybe three. And maybe tomorrow will be easier. I don't really know how it goes. But I definitely feel like it's about motivation, and it's about self-control and things like that. I realized today that when I didn't really feel hungry, I just kind of felt tired. And then every time like I'd see people snacking or eating something or I'd like smell someone making a bagel, I'd think like, hmm, I should find something to eat. But it's like I, I didn't feel hungry. So I think that this is kind of just me really learning about my body and learning about the way I feel and things like that so I can make better choices in the future. I feel exhausted and my head kind of hurts, but it also could be the weather. It's cold and stuff and I have like a little sniffly, so who knows. But we'll see how tomorrow goes. Um, but that's it for today. All done. All right, headed into work. Day two of the juice cleanse. I woke up feeling really good, actually. Slept really well, surprisingly. And we'll see what Josh has for me today. Day two of the juice cleanse i'm here not actually bright and early but you know we're here and no one else is in the office um bright and josh is going to tell us what we have for the day as always we're starting with the wheatgrass this is actually much more wheatgrass than yesterday but i put a bit of orange and persimmon in there then we've got breakfast strawberry mint and grape juice oh my god it sounds so good oh my gosh the strawberries were so good in the shop yesterday um then this is lunch i think this is mad green. This is chard, celery heads, cucumber, apple, ginger, and lemon as lunch. Then we've got an afternoon snack, which is orange and persimmon and a bit of ginger. No, yeah, I think. And then dinner is beets, apple, and orange. That's the day. What bracha is it? Hadzama? Sahakal? It's all vegetables. <laughs> this is going on the office. <laughs> I actually really like it. Oh, wow. <laughs> the lemon and the celery are really good. Sorry, Amy. <laughs> I didn't like the green one, so Josh is mixing this one with the green one because he's going to make me drink it. Can I be in your movie? That's Alex. He just is laughing at us. I feel as bad as I look. So, juice cleanse day two is kicking my ass, basically. I was doing okay until I left work, and I have a headache. And yesterday, although I did not feel hungry, today, I just want to eat some food. And there's all this cheese over there and I'm not gonna touch it. And this is Sophie, in case you forgot. <laughs> and she's here for moral support slash we're gonna enjoy some music at So Far Sounds. Slash husband husband. We're also always looking for husbands, so, you know, send them our way. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna drink some juice. Yay. <laughs> okay, on my way to day three, and the final day I've decided of the juice cleanse. Last night was mentally a bit harder for me. And I also woke up feeling a little bit sick. I'm gonna finish this and it's gonna be fine. Oh, hello. Welcome to day three of the juice cleanse, the final day. So today we have for breakfast, my favorite one. I don't actually know what's in it. It's mostly persimmon and other orange things, probably carrots. I don't really know. We need to find Josh to explain it to you. Then we have pure beet juice as a late morning snack. And then the final juice of the day is this one that I'm assuming, let's smell it, is mostly strawberries, but I think there's beets in it. Um, and this is supposed to be like the end, the treat, and Josh says by the end of the day, I'll be eating solid foods again. I can't wait, yesterday was really emotional. I think the juice cleanse takes an equally mental toll on you as it does a physical toll. But I feel really proud of myself and I feel really motivated and I feel really ready to make new goals in my life and achieve them. So yay 
for the last day of juicing and soon you will be seeing pictures of delicious food on my Instagram again. Midday snack, pure beet juice, which is making my lips look all stained, but luckily it matches my outfit. America loves beets. America runs on beets, not on Duncan. <laughs> and I've obviously lost my mind from drinking juice for three days. Home sweet home and finished with the juice fast. Yes, thank God. But of course, as much as maybe I wanna eat like a hamburger or pasta or something really yummy, like mm, macaroni and cheese sounds good. Um, you can't do that. You have to like slowly kind of bring yourself back into real food. So I'm gonna break my juice fast with like a super yummy salad, which is what I eat most yeah, most nights anyway, so it's really just not a big deal. So I just went to the grocery store and bought tons of veggies. Got baby spinach, red peppers, this like shredded carrots and cabbage and kohlrabi stuff. Kuspera, I'm blinking, I'm blinking. Um, cilantro and parsley, oh, a little bit open. Cucumbers, some sunflower seeds and almonds. So that's what we have for today and I'm gonna make enough salad for tomorrow for lunch also. So thanks for watching that video. I hope you enjoyed and were entertained by my shenanigans and the juice cleanse. If you want more details on like what was in each juice and things like that, I wrote a blog post and the link is in the description below. So be sure to check that out. Feel free to direct message me on Instagram. Um, that's at my best bro Amy and I'm love to chat about it. And of course, please like in this video and subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate your support and I've been getting so much love in the last week or so and I really appreciate it. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.